What's up, everybody? So this is my first screencast like ever. Woo! And I'm going to use it to show you what Pearson Realize looks like when you are reading the stories there and some of the stuff you could do. So let's keep it short and sweet. You go to classes and the orange part. And you're going to see the assignment right there. So you click on it. Let's go to this one right here. And it'll open the story. So every time we read a story in class, you don't have to use the physical version if you don't want to. If you're more digitally inclined, you can use what you're seeing on screen right now. So the cool thing with, with Pearson Realize is that it does give you an auto file. So check this out. Old Man at the Bridge by Ernest Hemingway. An old man with steel rimmed spectacles. I don't even have to read it anymore. I could just listen to it or you can like read it and listen to it. I know that that works for me. That works for me as a reader as well, because it, it just does. It's almost just work that way. <laughs> right. Anyway, something else you can do, as you can see right here, is the highlighting. So all you got to do is just highlight whatever you want to. Whatever you think is important. Save it. So every time you read, every time you come back to the story, your highlighter does stay. So these are your personal notes. Now, I'm not going to go into your stories and see who highlighted and who didn't. This is for you. I would highly recommend highlighting, though, physical or digital, just so that anytime you catch something important in the story, it's documented. You don't, So when you go back to reading the stories again, you don't have to like reread the whole thing. You can just look for the important stuff. So... The digital version of the book does give you, so besides highlighting, you can also circle like specific things. Let's say the word spectacles is super important or maybe underlining it, it just works a little more for me. So I'm gonna underline that. So that this is when, when you highlight like an entire passage, maybe there's like a whole, like one of the sentences in that whole part that was super important. Like, yeah, this whole thing's important, but this one sentence, that's the one, that's the money maker right there. And now I'll remember, oh, yeah, this whole thing's important, but this is where, like, the main stuff's at. You can mess with it all these different ways. So I would highly recommend trying it at least once. Just go in there, mess with it, have fun with it, and it might just work for you. I mean, you have the option of either one. So that's pretty much all I got. We will see you next time. And now I need to figure out how to turn this thing off. Oh, yeah, I can draw. Bye.